Um, so Ben, you, you've racked over uh, 100 Saracens appearances already for the club, so tell us what that, that means to you, um, to you know, play so many times for, for this club. Um, yeah, I think it's, uh, it's a huge honour um, to play to play once for this club. I mean, to play 100 is, um, you know, I, I joined um, sort of hoping to play here and there and then ended up getting thrown in at the deep end. Um, and yeah, here we are sort of 100 odd appearances later. It's, um, it's, it's a real privilege. So you joined from the National League One um, originally when you signed for Saracens. Could you explain the, the circumstances uh, in, in which you joined? Uh, yeah, so um, I got a phone call in pre-season. Um, I think it was just before pre-season. Uh, was on holiday. Um, they wanted someone to come in, train and things like that. So I came in um, and it was the World Cup in 2011, I think it was. Um, so obviously Wiggy was away. Um, I think Neil had had a hip operation, so uh, there was me and Luke Baldwin, um, and then unfortunately for Luke, he broke his leg, uh, and then it was then it was only me really. So um, my first game was actually Toulon away in pre-season, um, so yeah, thrown in straight away in, into that cauldron, and things sort of spiralled from there really. Since then, obviously, you've played over 100 games and you've recently signed a new contract. What is it about the club that makes you want to stick around? Um, mates, I think. I think, um, yeah, it's it's one of those clubs where um, I enjoy coming to work. Every, it's not work. I I, I, um, I don't see this as, as work. I see it as, as coming to an environment where I enjoy every day with... Um, with my friends and um, you know that that for me is was a, a, a massive reason for, for staying on. Since obviously Neil, Neil retiring and now in, in constant rotation with, with Wiggy, you're feeling um, you know more and more Prem and, and Champions Cup <coughs> game time um, is, is improving you as a, as a player here? Yeah absolutely, um, the only way you improve is, is by playing so um, I think this year has been brilliant for me um, you know to to both start and come off the bench, um, I think, um, yeah, it's been uh, it's been a massive it's been a massive for me to to improve my game this year. The the game time that I've had, so um, you know, hopefully now uh, we can or I can kick on from here and 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 only get better. You scored some 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 tries and some pretty uh, pretty big games. He, was he recently scoring against. Claremont in front of a you know pretty pretty huge atmosphere at the weekend. So as a player, what's it like to to score in those those sort of games and, and get that kind of game time? Uh, pretty special. Um, the yeah the the weekend was an atmosphere that like I'd never experienced before. Um, you know it was you couldn't hear the person next to you, so it was um, it was yeah it was very very special. Um, but. In those moments, you don't you you not to focus on the crowd. You focus on doing your job, and you sort of blur everything everything that's going on around you out. So um, you know, yeah, the weekend was was very special. But um, you try and sort of focus. You try and focus in on the moment, um, and try not to let the atmosphere get to you too much. Eva, you obviously have you benefited into. You know, Good run into the team now. What are your your personal goals uh, short term? Um, I think just um, keep trying to improve week in week out. Uh, um, yeah, just keep getting better. Um, Coming every day uh, to the club and and keep improving on on my strengths as well as my weaknesses. Um, and hopefully, if I do that, then it can only take the team to better places. And then looking further forward, what do you think this um, this team can achieve this season? Huge things. I mean, um, we've obviously had uh, a tough run uh, the past few weeks, but uh, you know, you saw at the weekend that um, there were the, for the majority of that game, we we felt like we were we were back. Um, so I think that that only puts us in good stead going forward. Uh, I think obviously, like I said, we had a, a pretty tough run, but. Um, the resilience this squad has shown in the past um, has has gone on to prove um, at the end of the season that, that we're in a very good place.